just... Okay, change the logo. <laughs> and I'm back with Banjo Dreamy then. I'm just gonna go ahead and delete that save file. Because that's what little I played of the game just to try it out and make sure that everything was working as it, as it was supposed to work. Best skin. Indeed, he's lonely here. <laughs> ah, that was the one. Check the link. Never seen it before. Hold on. Then, before I go any further, if my PC will agree to show it to me now that I've launched this thing. Banjo Kazooie Gruntilda's mask download. Is that. Uh. Ah, okay, a Zelda Majora's Mask inspired mod. That's something I'm gonna have to check out at some point, uh, Panda. Yep, never heard of it either. I had never seen Dreamy either. So, that, that means you and me both, then that way. <laughs> yeah, okay, so as you start, you got no moves. Not even the basic moves from Benji Kazooie. You have to to win everything, it seems. Let's go see what's th what's over there. This is a note door sealed by a logo with one of his powerful musical spells. <laughs> To open it, you must collect the musical notes from the world. Number on the door is the strength of the spell. The combined total of all your best note scores from the world must be at least this to break Logo's magic. Wait a second. Who's magic? Was it Logo that toilet in Grunty's haunted house? What did we ever do to him? <laughs> this doesn't make much sense. I guess we should keep collecting notes so we can get out of here. Yeah, I suppose the title indicates that this is all supposed to be a dream. Yeah, I don't even have any attack moves when I start. Because <laughs> you need to find all of your basic, basic moves all over again. Glowing Gardens. Wait, 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 wait. There was something there, wasn't there? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Seems like you can... Ah, yeah, I didn't see that Onicom at first. Okay. Uh, oops. Ah, yeah, shit. Hold on, I'm gonna set my control my, my controls the way I like them. Uh, on the X button, I'm gonna put C right. On the Y button, I'm gonna put C left. On minus, I'm gonna put the menu. On ZR, I'm gonna put the R button. On ZL, I'm gonna leave it that way. Here, I'm gonna put C up. On L, I'm gonna leave L. Okay, that's it. Oh, okay, then now, now I have my camera movements the way I like them. <laughs> Glowing Gardens. So in this game, from what I gather, there are no jiggies at all. You only collect notes. And because you don't have all of your moves when you start, it's impossible to get all the notes in the stage on first try. So that means you have to revisit levels multiple times. Now, th because this is considered a separate virtual console release on my console, I have to reset them f specifically for that game separately from the other one. That's how it quote-unquote works. <laughs> Official virtual console releases are, are like that. Now it now it's gonna be saved permanently for that game from here on out. Uh. Hey Banjo, I hope you're not afraid of heights. I'm not. Tell me about flying, Root Muncher. Not yet. Banjo, jump onto a tree and use the control stick to climb up or down. Okay. Yeah, can I climb on those? I guess so. I 
I'm not sure I like that I can't fight, but... Oh, it's letting me climb on those. Yeah, 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 yeah. I saw something that I was supposed to climb on. Ah, oh, yeah, there. Here. Uh. Ooh, 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 this is narrow and slippery. There's a music note over there. Ah, yeah, I for I forgot. I don't have I I can't use Kazooie to to jump a bit farther. It forces you to re rethink how you play the game, doesn't it? Uh, uh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> uh, start over, I guess. Ah, uh, it's. I can't explain it very well, but. I expect to be able to walk off the leaf straight onto the branch, but it's not programmed that way. Yeah, I can see why now, but... Yet, yeah, Banjo's tiny hops really don't give you much to work with. There's that note down there, and I need seven, so... This is Kazooie's shock jump disc. Find me, and I'll tell you how to use it. I'm always afraid... Yeah, there we go. I wish they had more notes. <laughs> but in terms of level design, I think it's really well made. Just not very practical <laughs> right now. Well, you know what? I don't know how useful extra lives are going to be in this one, so I might want to grab that one while I can. Yeah, see, this is what I meant about Benjo 3E here. It doesn't quite feel, feel quite so empty. Ah! Uh, It's not really a Kaizo game by any means, but... Okay, don't... don't miss that jump. I'm not, yeah, if it's okay, I guess it gets the job done, but it's not Grand Kirkhope. You can, you can hear, you can hear the difference. Mm, can I make it? Seems pretty far for Banjo's tiny jumps. I just feel like it isn't the same without the jiggies and the, yeah, right, yeah, I, I get, I get what you, what you mean, yeah. Okay, I could make it. <laughs> or at least it feels slippery. I can't really get the camera angle I want, but okay. 
Isn't that the top? I think I saw the top there for a brief moment. Yeah, there's first person view. Yeah. Okay. Well, I still want to finish getting... Wait, is there a hole in the ceiling? Because otherwise that thing there is useless. No? <coughs> I was gonna say, why put that disc there otherwise? Come on, Rudy, don't fail. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, yeah. It, it, even though it doesn't look like it's a, a really big slope, you still slip down. Well, okay, that's all of them. There doesn't seem to be anything left. Ah, uh, no, don't die on me now, stream, please. Oh, okay. It seems to be back to normal now. I hope. No, it's not. Uh. If my internet starts acting up like that, there is nothing I can do to fix it. <sighs> I hate it when that when that when it does that. Uh, I bet it. I, I bet it looks like a slideshow right now. It's not gonna get any better. Yeah, it's my internet connection. I, I might have to stop the stream. I'm afraid, because it's gonna it's gonna keep being like that uh, for for the rest of the evening if it starts doing that now. Uh. I might actually get disconnected completely. I know. Yeah, okay. Well, you know what? I'm s I'm terribly sorry. At least I could finish Banjo Kazooie. There is that at least, but it's not it's not you. It's not you. It's my internet connection. Unless it's fixed now? Uh, it seems to be back to normal. Knock on wood, as they say. He's gonna believe that it's because he refreshed, but actually it was my internet connection because I could see it already here. No, okay, that seems that's that seems to be back to normal. Okay, well I don't have to stop playing then. That's a relief. I just hope it doesn't happen again. Okay, so what about yeah, yeah in that area? What's left? Uh, there's a door here, but yeah, I bet I need something to be able to open it. Yeah, but it's not because you refreshed, it's just my internet connection that just happened to start working <laughs> right again. But I could see the problem on my end, so it's, it was not on yours. What's that, a power outlet? Hey, that's nice, nice detail. Yeah, there might be a delay, but there's always some kind of delay. Unfortunately, this is something I can't... Like... <laughs> it's something I can't remove. Yeah, I think in this in this level, I think that's all the notes I can get for now. Uh, hold on. I might, I might not be completely done. Oh yeah, I can't attack. Yeah, I'm stupid. Uh... Yeah, but that thing in the way, there's no way for me to get to, to get there. And there's one of Bottle's uh, mounds there. It's fixed now, just need to refresh to fix delay. Okay. <laughs> Good then. Yeah, I wanted to show that because I noticed that last time. Yeah, see, it, it tells you the, the, how many nodes there are, but there's no jiggies. Like, ever. From what I can understand, there's no jiggies in this one. But the guy who made this, it's a Brazilian guy. 
He's working on another one right now where there will be jiggies. The music was a few seconds off when you unpaused. Ah, that might have been. Can I jump over? Ah, it's not gonna let me. I'm not gonna be able to cheat my way through that through, through this one. What's wrong, Banjo? Is it tough? Let me know when you've had enough. <laughs> you twirl the 25 notes, but you won't always be able to find all of them at once. Yeah, learn new moves and come back to find all 25. Magic stops you from taking notes of the world. That hasn't changed, so you have to recollect the notes you've already found. Well, I, I, on the one hand, I'm not a big fan, maybe, of the fact that there's no jiggies. But I can appreciate that at least it forces you to approach the game in a new way. It doesn't feel like the original. Not, not completely. This is something I can appreciate. Yeah, this is perhaps the part of the game that I'm gonna like the least. The backtracking. It's probably gonna be very severe. At least the Xbox version lets you keep the notes. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. What is this thing? Okay, so un unless you have visited that other level first, you would not be able to, to climb this. Twinkling tunnels. See, I quite like that kind of little detail with the crystals around around the, the door and everything. That's really nice. Huh? What? <laughs> okay. Not quite sure what happened there, but... An attack move would, would, would go a long way, I think. Secret door. <laughs> Unless you, g I think, I, I think I glitched through it, but maybe I was meant to. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that might have been intended that way. I'm reminded of a level from DK64 when I see those crystals on the walls. I just saw a node through the door there, through through the wall. That's nice with the the gold there. I know they took that from another game, but from Banjo Tooie probably. Ah, let me attack already. Like you can jump on this. Yeah. Okay. Well, completely useless. Mm, I can see bottles is over there. I can't swim yet, so I can't go down there. Oops. Is there anything I can do in this level at this point? Tempted to think that no, <laughs> you can't. Yeah, I would need to at least be able to jump further with Ken Kazooie, but I can't. Yep, I think I'm better off leaving for now. Wow, your best note score for this world is one. <laughs> one. <laughs> oh, there's probably something up there, isn't there? Oh yeah, there's a m mumbo token. Okay. Where to then? Um. 
nothing up here. Because I already tried the glowing gardens and I couldn't get all the way to the end. No way, there. Maybe if I keep going further back. Yeah, that way. What was that way again? Ah, uh, yeah. There, m maybe there's more to this place than I initially noticed. I'm stuck already. <laughs> well, that's the thing when you play these the, these games for the first time. Even though you already played the original, you can't really be expected to know what what to do. Mm. Well, going in the water is probably not going to help much. When the back of Logos handle whoops your butt, you'll hardly stand. Oh, okay. If you say so. I expected a rhyme or something, but... Well, I'm going back in there, but I didn't see anything the first time around. I don't expect to find anything new. Well, I can see notes up there, but I can't go there yet. That's the notes I already collected last time. Is there something I miss? Okay, no, it's up against the wall, so there's nothing behind there. At the check, though. Or is there more in that first level that I could do, but which I didn't notice? There's a lamp up there. Yeah, you probably have to fly up to be able to reach this. Yeah, but here I I, I don't have a higher jump than, than this, so... And I can't swim yet. At least I don't think so. Yeah, yeah, I can't. It's back to the first level then. Because this is the only thing I can think of. So far, at least, the camera never really gets in an awkward spot or anything. I think there is a lot of, of thought that was put into the... Programming the automatic camera angles. But in places like here, for example, it's fixed. You can't change the angles, so... Alright, back to the glowing gardens then. What did I miss? Well, I can't climb any higher on those. I've already been in there. Mm, 
I might be able to jump on that flower and then reach reach up there. I didn't realize at first. Ah, oh, yeah, that might be a requirement. Can't believe I didn't realize this sooner. Ooh, yeah. If you have to reach this, it's gonna be tough staying on it. Banjo would jump a little bit farther. <laughs> hmm. I'd like to put the camera behind him. eager to get to it, I tried to jump and I fell off. Impatience is not rewarded. Yeah, but it's the same in the original. When, the, when you're trying to put the camera behind Banjo when you're so close to a wall, it tends to not want to remain in one spot. that spot where the, with the nodes over there. Okay. Well, up there, there doesn't seem to be anything else. Got on it earlier. Ah, there we go. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can jump there, and even if I did, I could only connect the note and I couldn't get any further. Hey, oh, yeah, yeah, it's the ghost. Clipping, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh boy. <sighs> yeah, I can't go any further. Jeez. Yeah, yeah, that's where I got the first move, so no need for me to go back there. I thought I might be able to reach where it said number three uh, on top of the door, but. Actually, you can't. I probably could if I could use the sh sh shocking. Sh what? What's what's the name of the move again? Shock jump or something like that. Yeah, with no way to kill the enemies or even break the the beehives. You can't even get any health back. An attack move at least, please. That would be nice. Because so far, well, okay, I reached a few a few more nodes that I couldn't reach before, but that's all I could do. Oh, there was a passage there, and I didn't see it. Okay, so what's it gonna be? 
Banjo, it's time for you to learn the claw swipe attack. What is it? I must know. Simply press B when standing still or moving slowly. Sounds good. What can I try it out on? Well, how about bird brain? Just try it, ball boy. Only kidding. Let me find something with a challenge. Ah, that's why they put the box there. Fucking Banjo. Could give me some health. Well, nice. Nice one. Try again. Hey, I want some moves. Maybe I'm gonna get all the attack moves if it's like in Spiral Mountain. Now try my fearsome forward roll. Oh, okay, I'm gonna get all my attack moves now. Okay, that's nice. At least I can defend myself now. <laughs> Stop rolling, I feel sick. It's time for the buzzards to learn... A what? An attack. The rat to rat to rap. R rat to rap. And they give you honeycombs just like uh, when you do it on Spiral Mountain. Nice. Uh, th see, that's weird. Because I already got one in this level, but it didn't count towards the level itself. Now that's not that that's something that doesn't make sense. Okay, well at least I can kill the the termites. Ah, that's nice. You think I'm meant to recollect all the notes I already did before? Oh, if, if so, that's pretty annoying, but... If that's what I have to do... Well, now that I have this, I can actually jump a little bit further. I might be able to use that. If that thing will leave me alone... Ah! I might be able to from that tree. Yes, yeah, sort of. Sort of. Yeah, I still can't get any higher. Oh yeah, there's one here. <sighs> that thing is still in the way. And with that, I didn't even, I couldn't even get the notes. Well, uh, hold on, there's the beehive. I'm gonna get some health from that. If it's gonna let me. back and collect those that I already collected then. Try to raise my score at least a little bit. Mm, 
Could I get to it from here? <laughs> Not really. How was the music made? I wouldn't know. Because I have not had a look at the banjo editor. I know the program exists because I've seen it. But I don't know if there is a, like a music tracker or something like that in there. I would venture a guess that it reuses the, the instruments that were already available in the original game. As far as I can tell, there are they are original compositions. I tried to time my jump to jump at the very last moment because I'm always afraid I'm not gonna make the jump and then I press the button too late. I'm sure some people can relate. <laughs> That's what happens when a, in a game they program such tight jumps. Where you have to be very precise. Well, you can tell difficulty was a, a concern when making that one. Okay, don't fall. Okay, now that I've got all the notes. So that's 14 this time. Before I leave this time, I want to make sure I'm not leaving anything else behind. As far as I can see, there's no nothing else I can do. Can't kill the ghost. Oh, maybe I can break that door now. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, well, it was just one note, but... Yeah, by the way, Bottles, Bottles didn't teach me some of the fighting moves. Ah, no, that's because on Spiral Mountain, the thing where Banjo bashes with his arm, that's considered a separate thing. Because this is a move that is used to break rocks. Well, I can't see anything else. I can't jump high enough to reach that door over there. At least I don't think so. I need to be able to jump further. But now that I can break down doors, I might be able to reach areas outside of this level that I could not before. So that's what, 15 then? Ah. Mm -hmm. 
Right, that door that I seemed to be glitching through earlier. Or maybe now that I can defeat enemies in that level where I was before, what, Twinkling Caverns or whatever the name was. It's good to be able to get some health back by killing these guys now. Okay, I was thinking about those, uh those frogs down there. It seems like they're meant to be uh, all killed and maybe that unlocks something. Well, no, that didn't do anything. Now that I can jump a little bit farther, farther than I could before, though, maybe I, nah, that seems, still seems to be far away. Nah. And even if I did, even if that works, I, where would I go from there? Well, there's a mole hill, but. It's not like Donkey Kong Country, is it? You don't get, you don't gain movement speed by, by rolling. No, no. You fall down pretty quickly. Oh, I made it. Maybe I am meant to to use that move to get across. tight. Okay, well I made it. <laughs> hmm, your jump could do with some help. Yes, it could. Ha! <laughs> what do moles know about jumping? <laughs> More than you. Press A to jump and hold it to jump higher. Oh, okay. Come on, feathers. You can give him a hand. Why? I'll look silly. I know it. Jump and press A again in the air for a double jump. Ah, oh, that's gonna help a lot. That's it. We're ready to move on. Not until you learn this one. First, you must stand like this. What? Wearing ridiculous glasses and a silly grin? <laughs> I'm not listening. Hold Z, then press A for the mighty flap flip jump. That's all the jumps. Keep practicing. Ah, uh, thanks, Bottles. Alright, there should be a much larger portion of the game open to me now. Uh, having said that, I still failed. Feels a lot less silly jumping like that way <laughs> than with that thing. Thought I saw something. Ah, notes. Okay. That was a chain of bad happenings. <laughs> Well, hey, you just passed your best snow score for this world. Before it was one, now it's two. <sighs> How 
do you get there? By flying, I guess. Have you ever played Super Smash Brothers? Yes, I have, yeah. Not all of them. I, I never played the one on the Wii U, for example, but... I've played quite a few of them, yeah. All, all of them except the one on the Wii U. And I don't own the one on the 3DS, but I did play it a little bit. Um... I do own Ultimate, yeah. I just haven't played as much with it as I should have, perhaps. <sighs> You'll reach new heights with my Shock Jump Spring. About time. Does Kazooie do it? My legs are tired. Don't worry, the turkey does all the work. Simply stand on a Shock Jump disc, then press an old A. I think all the dialogue that is tied to learning new moves with bottles is just carried over from Banjo-Kazooie. I don't think that's changed. I read your info wrong. I thought it says you only play past Nintendo games. No, I, I also play current releases and I do stream them at times, but... I usually focus on older games. But I did not mean to say that I play exclusively those. Okay, what now? Oh, okay. Ah! Fail! <laughs> that was a nice fail. Oh, it might be easier to get it from here. Oh, you can grab onto that thing that's hanging from the ceiling. Or I thought I could. I couldn't see anything with that funky camera angle. Actually, I didn't see it, but it's a minecart, that thing. Nice looking minecart, too. I don't know if all the models in this game are original. But I quite like the modeling in general. that thing ah yeah okay it's rails actually and that's why the minecart is fallen oh nice attention to detail that I like that when the scenery tells a story of something that's happened before I, li I like it I like it ah, it looks like you can grab onto it though thought so. There's an extra life there. There's a... A note on the other side. Make it. Okay. I guess. Well, you know what? I want to see what's that way first. Feels a bit unusual for Benji because we, but I'm liking it so far. <laughs> what's that dynamite stick? As a light source, yeah, that's not dangerous. Ah, that takes you back there, okay. Yeah, that's where I was before. Yeah, 
well, if there's something there, I guess I'm not collecting it with that thing around. I guess it's the ghost of the th of the thing that's in the in the grave, perhaps. <laughs> I guess it's meant to to tell you that. Yeah, there's a note up there, but with that thing around, tough luck. Ah, no! But I attracted its attention now. Yeah, when the camera is fixed like this and you can you have no control over it, that makes it tough sometimes to 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 jump. I gotta say this is one thing about that rum hack that I don't like all that much. Oh, there's nothing else up there. I went there expecting. Ah, oh yeah, maybe uh, you're meant to use that one to get across, perhaps. Wire. There is this thing called Banjo's backpack. What do you mean by that? It seemed like I was supposed to be able to climb onto the lamp. Ah, there we go. That's how it. That's what it's called, the banjo editor, as I called it earlier. That's the actual name. Yeah, I might. I might have gotten that wrong earlier. Yeah, I admit. I admit. Okay. Well, there might be more in the level, but that there's. That's all I can get for now. I think. Well, there's health here, so... Make enemies smaller? Mm. Yeah, you can make a lot of things smaller, I, f I think. And this is something that, that Rare used to do a lot. Like how in GoldenEye, they would make the models of the car smaller to use them as makeshift models that they would put on tables, that's why they would be explosive, like the real ones. Like, miniature cars were just simply cars made, actual cars made smaller. <laughs> so they would explode just like the big ones. Just as destructive. Oh, I got it on first try this time. Now I'm reminded of the... What, what's the name of the mine in, in Banjo-Tooie again? Gl Glitter Gulch Mine, sorry. The name... I couldn't remember the name for a second. Ah, okay, yeah. But, uh, yeah, you slide down. I can't turn the camera, so I can't see where I'm jumping. And they've done it on purpose. I think I have to go on that mound of coins to... That pile of coins to the left. Where to next? There? Uh, probably not. Uh, you have 
to be on that platform and they put an enemy there. Whee! On purpose, Ooh. no doubt. Whee! By design. <laughs> do I have to, to... Nah, I don't have to go for that other pile, do I? Or, or maybe I do. And it had to be the type of enemy that you can't permanently kill unless you have the the gold f the the move with the gold feathers. That's also by design. <laughs> yeah, I have to do, I have to restart just because I had to collect that note. Just hope I don't die before I get there. Forgetting something else. I hope not. Ah, yes, there was another note over there. So you have to jump where that red feather is there. Ah, well, count your blessings, Rudy. At least there is no enemies. This time I think this is everything. Ah, oh, that's that's it? Oh, okay, I didn't see that the passage was blocked. Okay. Well, that might actually be everything I could do in that level then. There was a door that required 20-something notes, I think. One more. Fourteen. Yeah, and then there's that extra life, which I guess you could get if you could fly. Right? I can't swim, so I can't go down there for now. I kinda get the feeling that you have to stomp the ground down there so that you can... There might be something hidden there. The ground looks too different for, for there not to be something that you're supposed to, to destroy there. Also, they're quite stingy with the feathers, aren't they? Ground stomp, yeah. Yeah, that's what I had in mind. Yeah, I feel like that's everything. Until I get all the moves, I can't get all the notes anyway. I have a total of 29 now, that should be enough. Yeah, that one, yeah, that was 21. Yeah, what about that door? Ah, uh, okay. Well, I <laughs> I still got the, 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 the token earlier without destroying the door. Okay, so you, I was probably not meant to be able to get it that way. They should probably make the, re make the recess uh, a bit bigger. What's that? What is that? Mm -mm. 
not sure. Yeah, that was a glitch. A tiny little glitch. Not game breaking or anything. But a glitch nonetheless. Well, that qualifies more like weak collision detection, more than a more than a glitch, but it's kind of the same th the same thing, it, something that was not intended. At any rate, I mean, that music track isn't too bad. Do I have to jump on that thing? Looks like a torch that's not lit. lit. Mm -hmm. What's that? Sparkling spring? Springs. Well, I have ten now. Something tells me I have to fly through that thing. And that's why there's a flight pad there. I should have expected that. Maybe you can break them open with the right move. So that's how you do it. Yeah, it was. It, yeah, it, it was clipped through the wall just a little bit. an awful lot of uh, red feathers in that level, I'm starting to think that this is where I'm gonna learn how to use them. That was the entrance. Okay. Uh, an extra life. And I can get, get behind the house. You will be off, okay. Yeah, you're welcome. My pleasure, obviously. Thanks for stopping by, Quillix. Have a good one. to clip through the, the umbrella here, maybe? I don't know. In, 
this case, I have expected you to, to have to keep flip through it. Uh, but I guess no, you're, you're meant to do something else. This is a really nice looking level. That might be reusing part of the assets of the level where they're with the scene at the end of Banjo Kazooie, though. With the sunset in the distance and everything. That might be reusing that. That might not be entirely. Uh, custom made. So many red feathers. Where's bottles? something over there. Has any Banjo-Kazooie hack made any new moves? I think that would be... That would be way more complicated than anything else. If they were trying to also had new moves. It's harder to do that, I think. Because that's actually whole new programming that you have to inject into the game. Whereas if you're simply editing the game, you can reuse a lot of the programming that was already put there by original by, by the original creators. That's a uh, another level of skill, I should think. It would be great if someone could, could make it. But I only just started scratch, scratching the surface in terms of Banjo Kazooie hacks, ROM hacks, so if there is, I might not necessarily be aware of it because I'm not aware of a lot of ROM hacks at all. What, that's it? Was just that note? Okay. I'm a bit disappointed. I expected there to be something more interesting than that. I feel like my curiosity wasn't duly rewarded. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I noticed. That could be this emulator, obvious, obviously, but it, it's also possible that it is something to do with how it is programmed, also. Okay, where have I not checked yet? 
up there, I guess. Through the roofs, perhaps. Hmm. Yeah. Well, and I can't swim. So I can't dive down there either. Ah, there's something up there. Up. Ah, yeah, a flight pad. Okay, yeah, well, I can't use that yet. Ah, I just noticed. Hey, an Onicom on top of the entrance. Wait, can you enter that chimney? I ah, know. From down there, it, it seems to be hollow, but it isn't. Well, I hope this is not slippery. Ah, uh, it is, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, it is. Uh, what, does that mean I can't finish this level? Well, finish exploring it is what I should have said, but... Hmm. I might have to be able to break these doors, but... Because the way that it seemed to be modeled, as if there was light coming out of it, if you look at the ground, it kind of makes me think that you have to be able to break them. This one too, for example. It looks like it's painted on the ground, so it has to represent the lights coming from the inside. And this one doesn't. Like, this one might not be breakable. I don't know. Or maybe I'm reading too much into this. <clears throat> I've already been down behind there, I think. Yeah. How many nodes do I have in this one? Five? And yeah, that's not much. You can climb? Mm, that might warrant a, a closer look. That might also not necessarily mean anything, yeah. But because the, because the door is closed, that made me think that this is the kind of detail that is supposed to stay there when the door is open. But like, again, I might be reading too much into this. Ah. I think that shark is a bit too fast. Yeah, but I think I need that move where you hold down the Z button and press B. If you go around, maybe there's a... A spot where you can start climbing the volcano. But I think I did already. Yeah, I can't climb any higher. Nah, I, f I feel like I should first learn how to fly. Oh, wait. Did I? No, I, I haven't interacted with it yet. That one. Yeah, there's a door up there. I, I'm... Oh, I'm gonna learn the talent trot. Excellent. Now I can get onto that roof I couldn't ri I couldn't go get onto earlier.
Okay. We're getting somewhere. Okay, what now? Now that I've made it all the way up here. What's that over there? Yeah, there's another feather on that big chimney. Yeah, you can clearly see there's a door, but there also seems to be a path. feathers up there, but... Ah, there was another honeycomb. Up there. Well... I don't see anything else worth investigating in this one, really. Other than that one move... jump on top of that thing. Actually, you can. Well, there, that's that. Yep, I think that's everything for this one. That's not a lot of notes, but... Oh, I, actually, I could probably get that on Ecom now that I just realized. If I jump on that torch there, that's not lit. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. So I don't forget. And that way I got the, I got the two from that level. I'm just going to explore a bit more now to see what else I could do after this. I wonder what's up with that. Your butt will tell you and you'll know when my bowel swings and fro to and fro. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Yeah, I might have to go back and redo some of those earlier levels again. But that's something that I'm going to have to leave for next time, unfortunately. Because I'm done for today. Well, I'm liking it so far. I'm, I'm still going to keep streaming that tomorrow. Maybe you have to find Mumbo. Well, it stands to reason that he must be somewhere in there, yeah. What's that? I mean, his tokens are in there, so... Yeah, I'm not so sure what's up with that. I had a problem like that with the other ROM hack as well, with Banjo-3E, where upon... Getting a game over, instead of going back to the title screen, I went back to a weird screen where uh, there was a grunty in her tea paws and everything. That was a bit weird. I'm finding a lot of tokens, but Mumbo isn't anywhere to be seen. Well, now that I found another one, I'm gonna save that. Yeah. And then, well, that's it from today for today. Thanks so much for watching, for being there. I appreciate it. I will be back tomorrow then with more of this. You have to teleport to get to the title. You have to hit Grunty. Ah. Well, that, that I shouldn't have to do that, though. I think that this is something that should be fixed. You should not have to do that. But I think I, I think I figured it out but because I did get to the title screen eventually. But that was a bit weird, shall we say. But anyway, yeah. Thanks for watching then. And I'll be back tomorrow night around the same time as today with uh, more of the same. Thanks for watching. See ya. Take care, guys.